YouTube world and welcome to another episode of the MWK Takeover. Are you ready? Let's go! I am so excited for today's episode. As you can see, we're gonna do a couple of science tricks. It's gonna be so cool. But before we start, I need to introduce you to my guest. You guys all know and love him. His name is Roberto, but we like to call him Big Toe. Ooh. Hey, Hi. how you doing? Good. Are you excited for today's experiments? Yeah, looks fun. <laughs> but I have no idea what is going on here. I'm legit nervous. You a little nervous? Yeah. Don't be nervous. You know what? So we can ease you up. I got mm -hmm. a couple of would you rather questions for you. Are you ready? Let's go. <laughs> so for our would you rather segment, I'm mm -hmm. going to ask you a couple of would you rather questions. Okay. Very simple. But kids, I want to hear from you. So you can answer those questions too, whether it's on our social media or on our website. Okay. Now are you ready? Yeah. All right, now first question is, would you rather be physically stronger than anybody else or be able to fly? Okay, but do we have wings or you just fly fly? Just fly fly I or like be Superman. strong. It's either or, either or. Uh, can I be like Superman that I can fly and be strong? No, Roberto, it's okay. one or the other. Would you rather? I'd rather fly then. Fly? Because you can go anywhere. And you don't need to take the subway, which is helpful. <laughs> yeah, that's a good answer. I like this. What do you guys think? All right, next question. Mm. Would you rather be reincarnated as a sea creature or an airborne cre creature? So now you can have wings if you want. Mm, if it's like an ego, it's like fast, you know. Like a strong ego. Yes, I'll American. be an eagle. Like, I will fly. I'll okay. keep flying. You want to keep flying? Yeah. What do you guys think? Would you like to swim better, be in the beach all the time? No? Or under the sea? Under the sea. Mm -hmm. Under the sea. I like water, so I would choose the, the, uh, the sea creature. Now, third question mm -hmm. is, would you rather never have a life without air conditioning or never be able to use the Oh, no, 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 no. We need the other end, say, say, please. Like, we fine with AC. <laughs> like, it's cold right now. So, we're cool. But people need to wear the other end. Like, yeah. No matter what that. the weather is, whether it's summer or winter, wear the other end. <laughs> please. It's essential. <laughs> it's essential. <laughs> that's great. Well, that's it for my segment. Would you rather? Now, that was a fun segment, right? Yeah. But, say, you set up all of this. What are we doing? Yes, I moved a couple things around because I want to show you mm -hmm. something really cool. Okay. So what if I told you that I can light this candle up mm -hmm. and let it stay lit even from underwater? But how come? That's impossible. You're talking about fire, water. I don't see that happening. Yeah, you think it's impossible, but mm -hmm. the magic of science. <laughs> no, just kidding. <laughs> but we can make it happen. So I'm going to need your help. Can you help me, please? Okay. So I need you to fill this bowl with some water. Okay. How much? Just as much as you can. Yes, that's good. Woo! Now, I'm gonna put this candle mm -hmm. right there on top and make sure it floats. Are you gently, sure about that? Gently. There you go. Oh. Now, I'm gonna try to light it up. Oh, <laughs> it's uh, parent proof, kids proof. Can you please uh, <laughs> light it up for me? Are you sure? Yes. It looks impossible, does it? Mm-hmm. Now this candle is lit and it's on water. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this jar and I'm gonna put it over it and it's gonna stay lit even under water. Okay. You think it's possible? Let's try. Let's try it, all right. So I got the jar right here. This is a suspense moment. <laughs> And I'm going to put it over the candle. Whoa! <gasps> Look at that! <laughs> it's underwater and it's still lit! Yes! Yes! That's cool! And guess what? It's even going to rise a little bit. Are you sure? Yep! <laughs> See, it looked impossible, but it is possible. Wow! And you know what that reminds me of? Today's top truth. 
Today's top truth is nothing is impossible for God. Yeah. Now, I know that there's situations in your life that seem impossible mm -hmm. and you really don't know what's going to happen. Can you think of any? Yes, yeah, so like when I was a kid, you know, there was a moment in my life that I thought that would be impossible for me and my family, like to pay the bills, you know. At some point I thought we're not even going to have food and we indeed we didn't have any food. But God sent someone to my house with grocery, you know, like, and it was a blessing. And I remember that the night before I was praying and I say, God, I would love to have this. It was like a cookie and a yogurt, me and my sister praying. And the next day, the same guy that brought like all the groceries, he had a special bag and he said, hey, that's a special actually. Remember that last night you were praying? I was like, yes, God sent this for you. So when I opened, say, say, was the cookies and the yogurt. So I thought that could that would be like something posh was like, how come? But God was listening. Yes. God was <laughs> doing the impossible for me. He yes. did for people in the Bible, right? Yes, he did. Like when they're crossing the desert, like he sent bread from heaven, he split the seas, mm -hmm. like how many cool things and impossible things for us. He he made it happen, but for us can be impossible for God. It's it possible. possible. And even Jesus did also a whole bunch mm -hmm. of impossible things. He fed 5,000, more than 5,000 mm -hmm. people that were hungry. He walked on water. Mm -hmm. He healed the sick. He even rose someone from the dead. Those <laughs> things are impossible, mm -hmm. but Jesus made it happen. Yeah. And maybe there's a situation in your life that you think it's impossible. Maybe you have a family member that's sick and you don't think they're ever going to get better. Or maybe right now you're in school and you, don't, you think it's impossible for you to pass the grade. Well, let me tell you something. There's nothing impossible for God. And you need to remember the word of God in Luke 1 verse 37. It says it. Nothing is impossible for God. So whatever it is, give it to God. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it doesn't matter to say it can look so big, mm -hmm. but nothing's bigger for God that he can, right? He can solve it. Nothing is impossible for God. Yes. And you need to remember that every day. You see this? We were able to put this light up and it stayed lit under water. Imagine true. the greater things God can do. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Do you have a trick you want to show me? Oh, actually I do say I brought this with me. Ooh. Okay. You want to hold up for me, please? Yes. What are you going to do with this Ziploc of water? Okay. I will. You want to see this pencil across this bag? Now, so you're going to make this water splash all up on my face. No, <laughs> I promise. You. It's impossible. <laughs> it's not impossible. Hmm. Just taught that to the kid. <laughs> okay. Ready? Ah! Ah! What? Oh my goodness! You want to see another one? No, you can't do another one. That's impossible. Yeah. No, it's not. Stop to say that it's impossible. <laughs> Ready? Oh! Oh! Look at that! That's cool, right? This is like? so cool, guys. Don't try this at home. Ooh, blue. You want me to try this? Yeah. So that's, mm, you know I'm clumsy. Oh, One, two, three. <laughs> I totally missed it. <laughs> Let me try that again. I don't have my glasses on. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> that was impossible for a son. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, we had so much fun today. Yeah, that was cool. Yes, don't forget to follow us on all social media. <laughs> yes, make sure that you follow us on Instagram and TikTok and Facebook. And mm -hmm. you can also, if you're not subscribed yet on our channel, make sure that you hit the thumbs up and mm -hmm. press the subscribe, mm -hmm. the little ring and alerts and everything that they have right here on YouTube. And make sure that you know everything that is coming up. Yes. And go to the website. That's right. Next week, we got a special Thanksgiving episode, so don't miss it, okay? Oh, I heard grandma was preparing something. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See you guys soon. Bye. Bye.